In today's tutorial, we're going to do a quick lesson on how to save your creations to Roblox. To save something to Roblox is very easy. For example, if I want to save this platform, I just right click on the platform and say save to Roblox. I have to enter the title and description and then I can select whether I want to allow other people to copy my creation or not allow them to copy my creation. Since here I have three different parts that are together that I want to save to Roblox. So what I want to do is I want to select all three of them. So I want to select the left staircase and hold down the control key. You can select the right staircase and select the platform and then right click and then say save to Roblox. So in this case, all three parts are going to be saved together as one object in your toolbox. Another way to save your parts to Roblox would be to group them into a model. For example, here I have the three different parts, the left staircase, the right staircase and the platform. I can right click and group them before I save them to Roblox. So um, I can rename this model to platform set, hit enter. And now I can do a save to Roblox. And then again, you go through the same steps. You enter the title and description and you, you decide if you want to share this with the public or not. Now, in this case, my platform set here also have two scripts that goes with it. I have a module script in the replicate storage and I have a script in the service script service. So what I want to do is I'm, I'm going to do it and then I'll, I'll explain. Um, so I'm going to rename this platform set to ungroup in workspace, right? So basically I'm giving myself instructions so that when I use this, this model in the future and I don't remember where everything goes. So I, I see the instruction here, it says ungroup in workspace. So I know that this, this belong in the workspace, right? And this, module script in the replicated storage, I'm going to right click and I'm going to group it. And I'm going to rename it to ungroup in replicated storage. And for the one in the service script service, the script, I'm going to right click and group and rename to ungroup in service script service. So I could be using this model maybe like a year later and I'm not gonna remember where everything goes. So this description here is gonna be very helpful. Now I just need to group all three of them together so I have the ungroup in workspace, which are my staircase here, the right and left staircase, and, and the uh, platform. And then I have the two scripts. So I'm just going to select all three of them, and I'm going to right click and group them. And then we can call this uh, changing color, change, whoops, let me see changing color staircase, let's say, right? All right, so now my changing color staircase has everything in it. It has the ungroup in replicate storage, which, which is the uh, module script. Um, it has the ungroup in server script service, which is the script that is calling the module script. And there is uh, this ungroup in workspace, which contains the left staircase, the right staircase, and the platform. All right, now, now we're gonna send this to Roblox. So we're gonna do right click and save to Roblox. All right, and we give it a title. This staircase 
will change color on its own. And the creator is me. And I'm just gonna, I'll, I'll allow copy for this one. And then, which means I'm, I'm sharing this with the public and I'm gonna click submit. Um, should I put something else in there? No, I'll just click submit now. And it's uploading and it has been uploaded to Roblox. Now I'm gonna close it. And now I'm gonna go to a different game. I'm gonna create a new game and I wanna see if I can get that model that I have just saved to Roblox to use it in, in another game. So I'm creating a brand new game. Let's uh, select flat terrain. And to use your model that you have saved to Roblox, you're gonna go to your toolbox. Remember the first tab here is the marketplace. That's everything that people have uh, save to Roblox and they, they they are sharing with the public and this creation tab here that's everything that you have saved to Roblox so you can see our new changing color stairway is right here right staircase is right here um, if you click on this the whole thing is gonna come into your and here you can just click OK See, the whole thing is gonna come into your workspace and what you need to do is you need to ungroup them accordingly, right? There, there should be three different models in here, right? But let me see if I can find them in the marketplace as well because I said to share to the public. So if you go to the marketplace and what, what was the name of that? Changing color staircase, right? Let, let's search for it, see if we can find it. Changing color stair case oh there it is look at that so so you can search by name right or you can search by creator if you click on this uh, little thing on this side here right and you can enter the the creator so let me, let me try it that way wait so before i do that let, let me get rid of this I want to clear this out so it goes back to the marketplace right and now I'm gonna search for my name here so you're gonna search by user here so I'm gonna enter price counter puncher price counter puncher and that's me right there I'm gonna select that and I'm gonna click I'm gonna click apply and there it is it's right here so if you if I didn't download it previously right I could have gotten it from here too from the marketplace if I click on it and I just say okay it goes into my workspace all right so now um, it's a good thing we have the instructions so what first thing I'm gonna do is I, I'm gonna ungroup this because this is a group right so I'm gonna ungroup this one first and now I have three different groups, right? So this one says ungroup in replicated storage. Uh, I didn't want to do that. Okay, so I'm going to drag it and I'm going to put it into replicate storage. Like the instruction says, right? And now I'm going to right click and ungroup. All right, so now it's in my replicate storage. The next thing is ungroup in server script service. So I'm gonna drag this, throw it into a service script service and right click and ungroup. And the last thing, it says ungroup in workspace. I'm already in workspace, so I'm just gonna right click and ungroup, all right? And there, there it is. We have the left staircase, right staircase and the platform. Now, if you click play, it should work. I just don't see, oh, it's far. Okay, I, I do see the uh, color changing. 
the left staircase has been changed, now the right staircase is changing. And it's done, now the platform. There it is. Okay everyone, so that's how you save your models to Roblox. So you can share it with your friends or uh, the public or you can save it for yourself to be used in a different game at a later time. Thank you for watching and we'll see you again soon. And if you are looking for some additional material to work on prior to the next lesson being posted, I would recommend going to our PriceCP Roblox YouTube channel Click on the playlist and go to our Price CP Roblox Extreme Short Series. In this series, you find that the lessons are taught at a quicker pace. So it's probably not the best for new beginners, but for beginners with some experience in building like yourself, it's probably perfect for you. So give it a try, check it out, and until next time, happy coding.